represent where you come from and what's supporting you. <clears throat> so now I got to cut you. Yeah, he biting the hand, huh? So I'm not answering Birdman's calls. I answered yesterday and I lined him up. He tried to get me on no jump. He tried to get me and I answered. I said, what's up? He said, I need to. I said, you're live on no jumper. I swear to God, y'all gonna see what it come out. You're live on no jumper. I hate he couldn't he talk to up. me about what he wanted to talk to me about. He had to go on the character. <laughs> he called me back after that all night. God was working. I left my phone at no jumper. <laughs> Yo, this nigga. So I got my phone from No Jumper, so seven calls from Stunner. So what do I do? Go to Clubhouse, oh, I no and I make the announcement. BG is a rat. Wacky, but I couldn't rep start this shit because this nigga, he'll show up at my house next. You know where I live at? Like, I know where he live at. Shit, Joe, y'all niggas crazy. Yeah, I, go, I get there because you can't just get in his house, but my name down there so the security don't let me up. They <laughs> called and tell him, yo, WAC 100 just came here in the penthouse. And then he'll text me and say, I ain't coming home for a month. I'm like, that's cool. I'm enjoying the city. <laughs> oh, no, he weird, too. Like, <laughs> yo, if r &B was in there, she'd tell you, she heard me and that nigga have a, a knockdown, drag out argument. She thought it was going to be a over the phone. Man, they don't, they don't get it, bro. That, that, that <laughs> just... That typical big homie, little homie shit, bro. They don't get it, man. This shit, this shit don't happen that way. Yo, she was, you should have seen her sitting on the bed looking. I'm like, nigga, you got me f***ed up. He like, nigga, listen here, nigga. I'm trying to tell you what the f*** I'm trying to tell you. Now, I don't give a what you trying to tell me, nigga. What I'm saying is, and everything went for like 20 minutes. Start this shit, because this nigga. And he said, all right, Neff, you got a point. You know, I love you, you hear? Be out there in a couple, in about two weeks. I'm gonna get that business done. <laughs> <laughs> That's real shit. Hey, uh, this time you got. And he said, "All right, Neff, you got a point. 